Okay, so it's day three. We've spent most of our day play, playing pattern games up and off on walls. Come and go get it in the front yard. Oh, peeing on bushes. You're really good at that. We only had one barking incident today. It's totally my fault. Like the guy startled us by the dumpster with a big plastic sheet literally two feet away from us. And I'm like, oh, that's fair. That scared me too, dude. Um, and he recovered really quick. Um, we've had a ton of opportunity working about people and he's now calm and focused and working, but he's still not excited to see people. He does now offer a lot more just natural check-ins, like he'll notice somebody and then he'll really quickly orient towards me. Sometimes we praise, sometimes we praise and treat, sometimes we praise and just kind of run and have a little happy dance. Things that make me super happy on this walk is he's gotten super playful twice. Once when he found a soccer ball, once when he found a giant pile of leaves to just do the zoomies back and forth in. Um, dogs that are in playful moods are less stressed. It is, I can eat when I'm stressed, so can he, but we don't play when we're that stressed in the moment. So the fact that I'm seeing more play outside is great and I'm gonna try to start building that in. You're a good boy. You do stop and sniff a lot of things because you're an impact teenage boy. Uh, but anyways, beyond that, really good. Um, body language is nice and neutral, open mouth. Tail's just kind of relaxed in German Shepherd mode. He's checking things out. Um, we did walk past a yard that always seems to have kids in it. Oh, and we're heading up to a yard that tends to have a beagle out in front of it. So we might cross the street just because um, we just had to yell at that man with the scary plastic and the scary dumpster. So. We might give any other problems a little bit more wide berth. So, keys are, I'm gonna keep doing what we're doing, we'll keep adding more skills in, but I'm really starting to look for not just him being calm and quiet, but him starting to notice people still at a distance, or dogs, and be excited to see them, and be more comfortable to see them. So, if all he is is neutral, that is fantastic but I'd like to see him, just because of his young age, actually get a little excited to see people. A little more wiggly tail, a little more wiggly body, but I am not pushing it. We're gonna let him come to that on his own terms. And if he doesn't, if he can just be neutral and we can decrease the distance we have to be from people, I will be thrilled. 